This video was made possible through a grant from the Haas Corporation. The Geek Group would like to thank Haas for their continued support in helping encourage innovation in design and manufacturing in America. The Geek Group proudly features ISCAR tooling in all of our workshops, videos, and hackerspaces around the globe. Hi there guys, I'm Chris Bowden. And I'm Iskar Rick. Welcome to the Geek Group. In today's episode, we're talking about recovery. Recovery. This is important. It's recovery is important. I've never actually used this. Well, it's in case you have a in case you had to push the big red button because you had an emergency. Now how do you get out of it? You push the button, now what? Now you turn it back, you hit reset a couple times no, and you go over your day. No, no, no. Well, if we're doing like uh, MDI and we do a tool change, that's doing a tool change and you Oh. Oh. Emergency so stop you sign. You can't just. Go ahead. Go ahead. Push the button. Tool change your home position fault. Okay. Tool. Light flashing? It won't, it won't let me. What color is the light? The light is red. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. So this is where you use recovery. Uh huh. Push the recovery button. Okay. All right. Oh, wow. An alarm exists. Yes. Carousel pocket down, double arm off position. Things are wrong, they're not in sequence. But this tells you what to do. Uh -huh. Alarms exist, they uh -huh. must be cleared. To continue with recovery, make sure the e-stop is released. Uh -huh. It is. Okay. Okay. Then press reset to clear all alarms. Uh-huh. Okay. Uh-huh. Carousel pocket is extended. extended. Double arm in between tool unclamp and tool position. Uh-huh. Okay, so there's A is automatic recovery. Yep. And E is exit recovery. Uh-huh. A. Well, what is the exit recovery? Oh, draw. Oh, wow, it tells you everything that's happening. Done. It's just cool. Press E to exit. Oh, A is automatic recovery. E yep. is you can exit A. the recovery thing that you're in. Exactly. Okay, now I get it now. That's it. You've recovered. Now, if things go wrong, like the for some reason you have very poor housekeeping and the tool is stuck in the tool changer or stuck in the spindle. Then they obviously didn't watch our last video yep. where we talk about how you have to clean that stuff out. That's correct, <laughs> right? Or you've... Uh, overfed the machine and you've hydraulically shut it off because you've exceeded the limits of the machine. Okay. And which, you know, which you can do. With so, this car tools. Of course. Okay. No, but that will help you get out of it. Okay. So when something, when you have to push the button, things are bad, this is how you recover to get I out of it. I like that it takes you through it step by step. Oh, yeah. It says, you screwed up, but this and here's is what you, you did wrong, and here's how to fix it. Yep. Wonderful feature. That's neat. So that's a recover button. That's the recover. Right there. Yep. All right. Well, is that it? Is that's there more? It. No, that's all. That's the whole thing. That's the whole thing. I like it. It's simple and it's important. I'm Chris Bowden. I'm Miss Rick. Thank you for watching. And as always, we'll see you next time. This video was made possible in part by Mastercam, whose CAD CAM software provides the base to all code generated for Geek Group CNC projects. The Geek Group would like to extend our deepest gratitude to the Gene Haas Foundation for making this program possible. Thanks to their generous contribution, we are able to train and inspire machinists all around the globe. Operating the CNC machines in this video risks personal injury and mechanical damage. Hazards may include electricity, untrained operation, airborne toxins, flying debris and noise, fire and explosions, poor shop upkeep, sharp tooling, projectiles, loose clothing, inadequate clamping, automatic operation, automatic tool changer, unsupported bar, over-tightened steady rest lack of enclosure, and impact. This video was made possible by a grant from the Future Girl Foundation. This video was made possible by thousands of private donations from members and viewers like you. Please visit thegeekgroup.org for more information on how you can donate and become a part of our dreams of Avalon.